All right, so we're back again. Uh, it's taken me a little bit. The capture card seems to sometimes just not recognize itself after it's been recorded once. So we hopefully are on the same track. We're on the right track. So let's go ahead and start with the piloting. All right, Starship uh, Aphelion controls. We we got it. Now this uh, I gotta turn my mic down. Hold on. Oh, I'm gonna get hit. These controls, th th this starship junk is horrible compared to uh, uh, Crack in Time. And I will be referring to Crack in Time quite a bit because it was a great game. The Crack in Time was kind of like an open world galaxy deal where you could do whatever you wanted, and it was really fun. Now, I've also done something else. I uh, I was like, you know what? I'm going nostalgic tonight. I put Aqua Teen Hunger Force on in the background, so it's like old times. I've got Aqua Teen playing behind me. I got the game going in front of me. I uh, I'm running up my electric bill like crazy, but whatever. You know what? It's mine to run up. We're just gonna move in a circular motion like this. Look at that. Boom, look at that. I found to do a barrel roll. Do a barrel roll! That was cliche. Well, what do you say? Oh, we can do a massive super attack. Oh, wow, that's awesome. Alright, that's cool. I don't know if... Uh, well, those were bonus targets. I guess. It's kind of tough to control both, but whatever. It's not that bad. I'm not even listening to the guy talking, so whatever. I'm sure you really should. Like, if you're enjoying this game alone, which I highly recommend, go pick this game up. Uh, <coughs> hey, I killed a grunt. <laughs> if you're a Halo fan, you probably got that. It looked like, looked like when you put Grunt Birthday Party Skull on. I was never a Halo fan until, or I wasn't a really humongous Halo fan. I'm, yeah, I was. Never mind. I can't even say that. All I know is picking something up. I have to keep taking a drink of water or I'm not going to be able to make it through this night. <laughs> okay, now we've got even a, a, a back view. Planks like Rambo on them. Ratchet's like, I got the front. You take the back, bitch. Planks like, yes, ma'am. I mean... I mean, I'm the bitch here. What the fuck? I shot that bonus orb. That's bullshit. That's alright. Our Everything's full. We're not even worried about it. This is like flying the gummy ship in Kingdom Hearts. Let's charge up a shot. Boom! Look at that! Oh, crap. That's what you get for drinking water. Oh, well. I really, really hate these parts, like, on-rail shooters or whatever, you know? I hate on-rail shooters. I never play them, like... <clears throat> I'm sorry, my, my throat is really, really fucked up, so that's why... That's why I cl keep clearing my throat. Alright, so... If I remember correctly, we need to uh, hit his eye. Yeah, we're doing damage to his eye. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, his life's going down, so whatever. And we're, we're evading his blades. I mean, this is pretty much it. Your reticle is controlled by your right stick, and your ship's controlled with the left. So as long as you stay in one spot with your reticle, you can just sit here and dodge like crazy. Shoot at his uh, forehead, I guess. His life's going down, so whatever. This is boring, I know, but geez, that's it's easy. Hmm. You added a beam to the mix. Beam to the mix, eh? We can uh, we can handle the beam. Oh, there's the red eye. <laughs> Got a brown eye. <laughs> Pink eye. 
Oh, we got hit. Damn! It took a lot of life away. Damn. He's uh he's figuring out my trick. And boom. Three out of five bonus. What were the bonus targets? Jesus. Uh, Minesweeper skill point. You can get skill points in this game, which was something really cool. Uh, in the original Ratchet Clank was getting the skill points. It's kind of like achievements. You got achievements for doing certain things. It was the first achievement system. All right. Rainy planets. Those are always good. Now, I believe this is the arena planet. <clears throat> And the arena became popular in uh, Ratchet and Clank up your arsenal, I believe. Or, no, going commando. And Quark is hilarious. However, Quark is one of the most annoying characters, in my opinion, because he keeps switching sides. Like, you never know which side he's on. And it's like, in this game, he's a bad guy. And then next game, he'll be a good guy. And armor vendor. All right, 25%. Now we're going to look like a badass for a little bit. Now, badass is when you get the, the last armor. The uh, <coughs> the deadlocked armor or whatever it's called. It's freaking amazing. Uh, it just changes colors until then. Then you look like uh, Master Chief. What the hell was that? I can't hear him, so... Whatever. Did I not turn subtitles? It's only... Boom! Shut up! Alright. Let's get all the bolts. Floating boxes. Carl is my favorite character in Aqua Team. He's a close... He's a close... It's a close... Uh, it's a close call between him and Shake. Meat Wad's alright, but whatever. Oh, okay. This is the first time I have ever, I mean, and I'm, I'm being honest here, this is the first time I've ever enjoyed making a Let's Play. Ever. Why? Because I'm not having to do anything different, really, than when I would normally play a game. The screen looks the same, it, it's just, it's in a lower quality, but it's really, you know, really you can't tell. <laughs> To tell you the truth, like 720, 1080, unless you're really, really paying attention, it's hard to tell. I really don't know what these are. I can't remember what these are for, but you gotta find them. Um, I think it's to gain entrance, but whatever. We'll get them all. Oh! Took a hit. But look, did you notice the armor helped us survive it a little bit better? We'll uh, use the gun here. As you notice, I'm not using the gun a lot. I like to use my wrench a lot more than the gun. But later on in the game, we're going to get to where these guys are going to become less and less. And uh, I should be using the guns more just to upgrade them. So which that's probably what I'm going to do. I'll switch to the Shock Ravager. That way, at least I can get some experience for using it. All right. This is a... Is that a Ferris wheel? Looks like a Ferris wheel. It's kind of a gloomy place to have a theme park. Boom! These guys, these poor guys, they, their lives are miserable. Look at them. Look how sad they look. I mean, you're going to end them anyway. Why not just just do it? Just do it. Boom, boom. <clears throat> Alright, where are the rest? Let's see. Does it show? Not really. Let's just follow this path here and see if we can't find one. Oh shit. There we go. Go this way. It's really colorful. That's what I like about these games. There's th it's a it's a good break from the grays and dark browns and shit of uh, of a normal uh, normal games. Electrical attacks are useless against an electrified <laughs> I should have noticed that, right? Damn. Well, try a different I will. Gee, you don't have to explain it, Clink. Damn. We use predator missiles. Look at that. Is that a nanotech upgrade? Great. I'm getting a cold. 
I'm getting a cold at the end of the summer. That's great. That's that's bad news, bears. That's bad news, bears, right there. Come on. Get up there. Get look at all them boats. Get all them boats. Uh, let's see. Let's uh, just just for shits, we're gonna fuck them up. Let's throw a grenade up there. Can't fuck them up, can I? That's bullshit. And we'll go ahead and wall jump here. Wall jump up. Take the elevator. Is that an enemy? Yep, sure is. Fuck his world up. Dude, you can't even get to me, so... Oh, shit, but his buddy can. Out of ammo there. So we'll just use our combustor. Combust you! The arenas are where you can gain some pretty big bolts and uh, rare titanium as well. Uh, because you basically just get it for challenges. Now, I think they're fun. They're really challenging, and, uh, can't wait to, can't wait to get in there and, and do it. My dad owns a dealership. <laughs> I'm serious. You're not going to get a lot of my references unless you watch Aqua Team. Uh, anything, anything on Adult Swim. I mean, if you get, if you guys like Adult Swim, tell me, and we will get along just fine. I remember, I was at the hospital one time, and uh, it was a, it was a really bad deal, you know, and there was this really cute nurse, and uh, I wanted to talk to her, you know, but I'm married, you know, or oh, well, at the time, you know, I wasn't married. I was, I wasn't actually even with my my wife. We were together. Uh, we we knew each other rather. Um, but she had a boyfriend in Florida, and she was with him, so it wasn't a big deal. But anyway, I thought she was really cute. And she was really cute. She was hot. This is a funny story because uh, she uh, she was outside my door one day, and I was, you know, I was sitting there thinking, I'm like, you know, I need to do something to just get my spirits up. I'm at a really bad time, and uh, I need help. So. I started going. I started singing the the theme song, rapping the theme song to uh, to Aqua Team. I'm like Shake Sula, the Makula. And then, long story short, since you don't want to hear me sing it, um, I, sh I hear her start. I, I stopped singing halfway through. I was like, this isn't working. And I hear her continue. <laughs> she continues with the uh, the song, and I'm like, holy crap! And she walks in there, and I was like. You're an Aqua Teen fan. She's like, yeah. And I was like, that's insane. So we got, we became really, really close. And um, I tell you the truth, I uh, I started kind of liking her. And uh, ooh, look at the new weapons we can grab. Uh, this is one of my favorite weapons right here. Uh, uh, this is one that we're going to be using quite a bit. So we do want to save up and get that. Um, that is the shotgun of the game. <laughs> shotgun has a. Uh, as a uh, SSOH PKC would say, "Shotgun Rain." That's his catchphrase. So we will, in his honor, we will be using that quite a bit. But anyway, um, so we became really close, and uh, once I was out of the hospital, we didn't keep in contact because that would have been weird, I guess, because she was my nurse, and uh, uh, I saw her in the mall one day, and I really I wanted to go up and say hi to her. She looked over and saw me and recognized me. But she just shook her head no, and then I noticed her boyfriend walked up, and she uh, <laughs> she had a boyfriend the whole time, and uh, she didn't want to uh, she didn't want me to see that, and she didn't want him to see me. So that sucks. Anyway, that was like in 2006, and to this day she still comes into my stores. So I see her every now and then, but she just acts like she doesn't recognize me. All right, making sure. All right, we got to go this way. Gotta go this way. We're going the right way. We're getting to the arena, slowly but surely. I did not find all those little parts. We'll go back and find those later. Um, I don't remember exactly what they do. And by the time this video is up, I probably will either not care or have gone way past it. Because at this point, I'm probably on part like seven. And. So, I've probably, and I haven't uploaded a part yet, I'm waiting until I go to bed to start uploading. Uh.